Learning about our genetics can be empowering, but it can also be overwhelming. Before getting into how our genes work together, things might be easier if we take a look at a single gene first. A gene is a lot like a 3D printer. As long as the required materials are available, the gene can create what's needed. But, if we do not have the proper supply, or we're not creating a demand, our genes cannot create the required products. Sometimes, the product a gene creates, is used to supply another gene's demand. And sometimes a gene creates or depends on an enzyme. A gas engine has a few examples of supply and demand. Without fuel, our engine does not run. But once our engine is running, it depends on oil. As we continue to use fuel and oil we will depend on engine coolant. Without a constant supply of these three cofactors, our engine cannot continue to run. The same situation is happening inside our metabolism's network of genes. Without proper stomach acid, magnesium, B12, folate, choline, methane, glycine, B6, molybdenum, selenium, iodine, copper, zinc, and so many other nutrients, we don't have the cofactors our genes require. So our genes themselves may not be our biggest roadblock. Visit www.methylate.me for more videos, and to sign up for our newsletter. Methylate Me is supported by viewers like you. If you enjoy this series, please consider helping the project grow.